Welcome to a journey of harmonious coexistence. Today, we delve into the canine mind, understanding how our furry friends perceive the arrival of a new family member. When we bring a new baby home, it's a joyous occasion for us, but for our dogs, it can be a confusing and even stressful time. Dogs are creatures of habit, thriving on routine and predictability. A new baby disrupts this routine, and your dog may feel unsettled or even jealous of the newcomer. So how does your dog perceive this change? Dogs primarily experience the world through their senses. They rely heavily on their sense of smell and hearing, which are far superior to ours. This means that the new sounds and scents associated with a baby can be overwhelming. Your dog might display signs of stress such as excessive panting, pacing, or changes in eating habits. They might also exhibit behaviors that seem out of character such as growling or snapping. These are all signs that your dog is feeling uneasy about the changes in their environment. It's also important to remember that dogs are pack animals, and they see their human family as their pack. The introduction of a new pack member can shake up the hierarchy and cause your dog to feel insecure. They might try to assert their dominance or they might become more submissive. When we understand how our dogs perceive the world and how they react to change, we can better support them during this transition. It's crucial to acknowledge your dog's feelings and reassure them that they are still a valued member of the pack. One way to do this is by maintaining their routine as much as possible. Regular walks, playtime, and meals can provide a sense of security and continuity for your dog. It's also important to give them plenty of attention and reassurance, showing them that they are still loved and valued. Remember your dog doesn't grasp the concept of a new baby. All they understand is change, let's be their guide. We'll explore more on how to do this in our next segment, stay tuned. Now let's help our dogs acclimate to baby-related noises and smells. It's all about gradual introduction. Imagine you're suddenly thrown into a different country where you don't understand the language the food smells foreign, and everything you know is turned upside down. It's quite disorienting, right? That's how our furry friends may feel when a new baby arrives home. So let's start with baby noises. Babies have their unique symphony of sounds, from cooing and giggling to crying and screaming. These sounds can be startling to dogs. Begin by playing recordings of baby noises at a low volume, gradually increasing the volume over time. This will help your dog become familiar with these sounds and not be alarmed when they hear them in real life. Next, let's talk about scents. Babies come with a whole new array of smells, from their unique scent to baby powder, diapers, and baby food. We can help our dogs adjust by introducing these scents gradually. Start by allowing your dog to sniff baby items such as clothing, blankets, or a used diaper. Remember, Always supervise these interactions to ensure your dog doesn't get too carried away and decide that these items are chew toys. The goal is to familiarize your dog with these new smells, not to encourage destructive behavior. Another effective method is to bring home a blanket or piece of clothing that the baby has worn from the hospital before the baby arrives. This will allow your dog to get acquainted with the baby's unique scent. Remember, this process is not an overnight task. It requires patience, consistency, and lots of praise for your dog when they react calmly to these new experiences. The key is to create positive associations with these new sounds and smells so your dog sees the arrival of the baby as a positive change, not a threat. With patience and consistency, your dog will soon associate these new sounds and smells with positivity. And that, dear friends, is the secret to creating a harmonious home for both your two-legged and four-legged babies. Safety is paramount. Let's move on to some practical training tips for safe interactions between your dog and the baby. As we embark on this journey, it's crucial to understand that every dog is unique with their own set of habits and responses. Hence, our training strategies should be tailored to meet the specific needs of our furry friends. First off, let's talk about setting boundaries. It's essential to teach your dog that the baby's space is off-limits unless invited. You can use barriers or baby gates to physically delineate these areas. Remember, it's not about isolating your dog but rather teaching them respect for the baby's space. Next, we move on to the no-jump rule. Dogs often jump out of excitement or to seek attention but with a baby in the picture, this behavior could lead to accidental injuries. Training your dog to stay calm and grounded, especially when the baby is present, is a vital step towards creating a safe environment. Now, let's touch upon the power of positive reinforcement. It's a training technique where we reward good behaviors, encouraging our dogs to repeat them. 
For instance, when your dog sits calmly as the baby is around, reward them with a treat or their favorite toy. This lets them associate good behavior with positive outcomes. It's also important to train your dog to respond to commands like leave it or back off. These commands can be lifesavers in situations where your dog gets a little too curious or excited around the baby. Lastly, never leave your baby and dog alone together, no matter how well-trained or gentle your dog may be. Adult supervision is always necessary to ensure the safety of both parties. Remember patience is key. These training tips are not a one-time solution, but require consistent practice and reinforcement. It's a gradual process, and your dog might not get it right initially, but with time, patience, and lots of love, they'll learn to safely interact with the newest member of the family. Remember, positive reinforcement is key to safe and happy interactions. Making your home environment comfortable for both baby and dog is crucial. Let's explore some creative solutions. When preparing for a new baby, it's important to remember that our four-legged friends also need their own safe and comfortable space. This not only promotes a sense of security for your dog, but also ensures the safety of your baby. Designing a dog-friendly baby zone can start with something as simple as allocating a dedicated area for your dog. This could be a cozy corner fitted with your dog's favorite bed, toys, and even a water bowl. This personal space provides your dog with a sanctuary, a place they can retreat to when the hustle and bustle of baby activities become overwhelming. Another great idea is to use baby gates or play pens to create separate but visible zones for your dog and baby. This allows your dog to observe and gradually get accustomed to the baby's activities while maintaining a safe distance. Incorporating dog-friendly materials in your baby's play area is another thoughtful step. Opt for durable, easy-to-clean fabrics for play mats and rugs. This not only makes cleaning up after your dog easier but also ensures your baby's play area stays hygienic. While creating a dog-friendly baby zone, it's also essential to dog-proof the baby's area. Safeguarding items like baby toys, diapers, and feeding equipment from curious dogs can prevent possible choking hazards or other accidents. Remember, consistency is key. Try to keep these designated areas consistent. Dogs are creatures of habit, and any sudden changes to their environment can cause stress or confusion. Above all, it's important to ensure that these changes are introduced gradually, giving your dog ample time to adjust and get comfortable with the new arrangements. Lastly, don't forget to reward your dog for good behavior around the baby's area. This positive reinforcement will help your dog associate the baby's space with good experiences, promoting a peaceful coexistence. A space that caters to both baby and dog needs will ensure a harmonious living environment. The journey to creating a dog-friendly baby zone is all about understanding, patience, and love. It's about building a home that welcomes and cherishes all its members, no matter how small or furry they might be. Routine and attention, two elements your dog needs even after the baby arrives. Just as we humans thrive on routine, so do our canine friends. Keeping to your dog's familiar schedule for meals, walks, and playtime can provide a sense of security amidst the flurry of changes a new baby brings. This continuity can help prevent feelings of neglect or jealousy. Remember, attention is not a finite resource. Showering your new baby with love doesn't mean there's less for your dog. Regular one-on-one -on -one time with your pooch can reinforce their position in the family pack and decrease potential anxiety. Let's turn to expert. Dr. Barker, a renowned animal behaviorist. She affirms, Maintaining routine and giving individual attention are key to helping your dog adjust to a new baby. It's about balance and reassurance. Balancing attention between your new baby and your dog will ensure a happy, stress-free home. Observation and flexibility will be your best friends in this journey. Now that you've laid the groundwork for a harmonious home, it's time to watch, listen, and adjust as needed. Noticing changes in your dog's behavior will be crucial. Is your furry friend more anxious? Perhaps they're showing signs of stress or jealousy. These are indicators that you might need to revisit earlier steps or introduce new strategies. Remember, there's no one-size-fits-all approach here. Every dog, like every child, has their own personality and needs. It's okay to try different methods until you find what works best for your pet and your baby. And hey, why not share your experiences in the comment section below? Your insights might just be the help another dog owner needs. Remember, every dog is unique. Stay observant, stay flexible, and embrace the joy of your growing family. Don't forget to subscribe for more insightful content.